There you go. Today, we're gonna bring a bicycle today. Not just any ordinary bike, it's a three-wheel bike. We're gonna open it up. And see what we get when you get something like this. So let's go ahead and open it up. All right, so this is how the bike comes in pieces, the three wheels, and then we have a basket. Um, we got a couple of items in here that came separate in a box. We got, first of all, got the seat, got uh i think this is a uh, part of the handlebar and then the reflection lights another reflector instructions and then the pedals itself so left and right very simple we're gonna put it together right now and see what it, what you get 99.6 of you are not subscribers in my channel i hope that the content helps you out and you find it very useful and i hope you hit the like and subscribe All right, let's talk about the bike itself. If you guys can see it, the hardest part was putting the basket, to be honest with you. Uh, tighten it up with the actual lug nuts and make sure that it has washers. It was a little difficult putting that in there. Uh, just to make sure it wasn't hitting the tire. Now, the tires are really thin. They're like, maybe like an inch and a half. Um, this is not ideal use for uh, larger adults. Maybe for, you know, teenagers, uh, because they're really small tires. Uh, uh, pressure, uh, IPS, uh, pretty much I put 16.5, close to 17 on air-wise, because I don't want to pop it. Uh, I like that they have everything labeled left and right. Now, the only reason I bought this was because this is foldable. You actually bend this whole frame to the right and you're able to take the seat and the handlebars easy the handlebar is the best thing to take off it's just a manual uh, uh actual screw that you actually lift and you screw unscrew it and the whole handlebar comes out um the only thing is that you have to attach keep this attached because it's the brakes and if you guys notice there's only one brake for the front tire and there is no brakes in the back um when you try to go reverse you can't I uh, had a lot of trouble with this little piece of metal here. Aluminum, it kept bending forward, but I was able to fix this. Now, this one right here, you got to make sure it's nice and tight or or it's going to open up. But it won't open up until you actually push up either way to it. That's another safety mechanism. So folding it, you're going to hit this tire. It's going to hit the other tire here in the back. But um, it's not going to give... You're still going to need some room in a car. It won't fit in a car. It has to be maybe in a SUV. Or truck or something a little larger because um, it does fold in half so you are gonna have half of the space it's gonna take um, but the actual whole system itself is a little bit large really large I mean we're talking about it's about five foot all right long all right and when you fold it it's about four and a half almost four to four feet to three and a half kind of like it's right there i mean five foot still long it's, it's a little long so you're still gonna have to fold it it's a space i'll put the details in here so you guys can see it but um the chain it was a little tricky because um this nut here was a little tr tricky too if you don't fold it or put it properly and you go in reverse the wheel could come off so you got to make sure you tie it up that's another important thing setting up it's not that hard you set up the two tires the basket the, the actual seat and the front tire along with this part right here this is a little tricky too so you got to make sure you have the right tools to 
to put it together or you're gonna have issues it was not that difficult but you still need some tools all right uh, brake wise I had issues with the brake I had to tie the actual um, string on the brake so so I could tighten it up a little bit more but overall I enjoyed the bike the kid enjoyed the bike it's for a teenager which is perfect I was I was able to ride a bike and I'm about you know close to 250 you know I'm not gonna say how much but a little bit heavier than that you could go a little bit higher uh, I was able to ride the bike but um, not my size if you want to increase the the lift just increase the size so you can increase the size that you could actually raise the even handlebars too so it's not bad for adults but I would suggest it's more like a a teenage bike or uh, or anybody around four and a half to five feet this is perfect for you guys so you guys are looking for a bike I hope you guys enjoy the show Ninety nine point six of you are not subscribers in my channel. I hope that the content helps you out and that you find it very useful. And I hope you hit the like and subscribe.